was great. It's, uh, it's a real pleasure to meet you. Well, it's a pleasure to meet you. I've been, I, I feel uh, like I know you because I really enjoy your show so much. Oh, thank you very much. Yeah, no, I, like, I, I love you and the, everything that's going on, especially that band there. You got a Yeah, whole, we have a great this band. This is real music. So nice. We have a great band. Oh, I am blessed. I'm a blessed yeah, man. You really are. It's really good. It's a nice, warm set. I love it. Yeah, no, we're, uh, we're having a good time. Good. And uh, you, you're having a good time yourself, actually. Lately, mm. you've had uh, a, an incredible, uh, you know, rise in popularity, and you're, you're, you're being played on alternative radio stations. A... Uh, you've been on MTV. Uh, really... What's going on? <laughs> I'd like to know. It's a new vein, but I'm not knocking it. It's fantastic. You know, all the, all the young adults in America have, uh, con they consider me cool. <laughs> That's great. Now, do you see them when you do concerts now? Thank you very much. You know, when you do concerts now, do they yeah, show you know up? What, what, it's really unbelievable uh, because uh, I, when this happened the first time, I mean, I was like the uh, the Madonna and the Michael Jackson of my day, you know. Uh, <laughs> and uh, but it was all so new to me. I was very nervous. But now the second time around, just being uh, a trooper and traveling so many years, doing it 45 years. F to have this happen with the young adults is fantastic, because I, I really know what to leave out now and what to put in, and I'm That's having more fun with it. We're, we're doing all these rock uh, Christmas shows all over the country, in Washington and San Francisco and Los Angeles and uh, yeah. Dallas, you know, and... and uh, boy, have you they... been changing what you're doing? No. Or you're just doing the same no, thing I've been, I've been and they're coming to you? I've been on I've been... I, oh. I, I, <laughs> I, it was just, uh, I go straight ahead with my great trio. Ralph Sharon's been with me 25 years now. Mm -hmm. And uh, we just play acoustical, and it, it, it works. For some reason, there's a, a change happening with the young people that are starting to accept all kinds of music now. No, oh, it's great. It is. Uh, and uh, I was going to ask you something. You did a, a, an album, uh, I guess, a few years ago, where you recorded all of uh, Frank Sinatra's yes. music. Yes, so we won the Grammy for that, Perfectly Frank, it's called. Right, now... And, uh, it's very good. Did, what's, uh, you what, what's your relationship with Frank Sinatra? Do you think that he's ever, you know, are you disappointed that he's not recorded uh, an album of your music, or do you think that's... Well, he did already. <laughs> he did? Yeah, he did. Uh, when he recorded with... I was the first guy to sing with Count Basie's band, mm -hmm. and the uh, first vocalist, uh, white vocalist. And uh, so then he did an album with uh, Basie at the uh, Sands Hotel years ago with Quincy Jones being the, the producer. And he did all, most of the songs that were very current at the time. And there was The Good Life and I Want to Be Around. And For Once in My Life, all these different songs that uh, I introduced originally. So he did many of my songs. What's your uh, relationship with the, well, he, uh, the two right here, big crooners right from that era? And, well, uh, yeah. He's 10 years my elder, you know. But mm -hmm. he, I, when I was a real young kid, I went to, to him for advice at the Paramount Theater when he was there with Tommy Dorsey. And, he gave me uh, so, uh, some great advice that I've, I've stuck to uh, and insisted on, and it's really helped me survive, because uh, he, he said, just stay with great songs. Many years later, just uh, as recent as last year, I said, why do you think we've been around so long? He said, because we stayed with great songs. That's terrific. Yeah. I, I was really hoping it was advice I could use. <laughs> <laughs> I don't sing. You, uh, <laughs> you know, what, what you have is a great sense of humor and a good brain, you see, and that, that's, that pays off in the long run. The cream goes to the top, believe me. Oh, well, that's nice of you to say. Yeah. I've got this incredible pompadour. <laughs> I think that's what it is. So <laughs>